So advertising is me putting out and, and me telling them who I am and giving them information. Sponsorship connects me to an organization that has some of the same beliefs I have that will also connect me to people that I can tap into their heartstrings. It's not done to manipulate, it's done to connect at a deeper level. Does that make sense? Okay, now y'all can ask me questions if y'all need to, because trust me, stuff is in my head. So <laughs> to connect at a deeper level, that is the difference and that is the purpose of sponsorship on both sides. When I normally go out and I do something for sponsorship, what I do is I offer them free services. I would go and I would ask, you know, what do you need? They said, we need some leadership training. I said, okay, in addition to this, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do leadership training. Or what do you need? I need um, I need an event. So I have an event that I have. Okay, well I have some connections and we have a sponsor who provides events. So I said, and they cater. So can they, can we barter some services? Because you may not be in a position to give money, but you may be in a position to give services. So now let's talk about that for a second because I'm an accountant. You shouldn't, uh, in that case, you have two options. You can give the, the entire service for free or you can give the service and only charge the next client only what it costs you up front. Like if you're going out and you're doing food, you pay for the food, I'm going to do the service. And she would do, can I use, I'm going to use you as an example, beat me later. <laughs> so if I, if I was going to take it and, and use that, then she may find somebody in the room that has a major event, that has a lot of foot traffic, you know what I'm saying, has a lot of foot traffic, and that people that are looking for something, maybe a wedding event that she can cater, it may be, uh, an event, but it needs to be something that she can utilize. 